I really wish I had a dog. So here's some Greek mythology about dogs. For all the cat people out there, I'm sorry, but there aren't really many or any myths about cats from Greek and Roman mythology. Sorry. Now we all know about Cerberus, the three-headed dog who guards the underworld. But did you know there was also a two-headed dog in Greek mythology? This two-headed dog, called Orthrus, belonged to the three-bodied giant Geryon. He comes up in one of the labors of Heracles where he needs to kill Geryon and steal his sacred cat. Heracles does, however, unfortunately kill Orthrus in the process. Now, you may have heard about the Carnis Major constellation in the sky, that there is a Carnis Major and a Carnis Minor. And since we've been talking about Harry Potter recently, the Carnis Major constellation includes stars called Sirius and Bellatrix. The story goes that there once was a dog, a dog created by the gods that would always be able to catch its prey. Whatever it was hunting, it would be able to catch it. The dog's name was Lilaps, and Lilaps loosely means hurricane. There are a couple of different myths about where Lilaps came from. In one, he was a gift from Zeus to his girlfriend Europa, and it was passed on to King Minos of Crete, who then gave it to an Athenian princess called Procris. In a different version of the myth, Artemis gives uh, this Athenian princess Procris lilaps as a gift. Procris's husband decided it would be a really good idea to get this new hunting dog to catch this special magical fox, a fox that could never be caught. So it was a paradox. Right, The dog would always be able to catch its prey, but the fox would never be caught. So they just kind of went around in circles chasing or being chased and nothing sort of resolving it. Zeus was like, oh, this is tedious. So he scooped up uh, the dog and the fox and threw them into the sky and made them constellations. And I think Lilaps is a pretty cute name for a dog. Hope you enjoyed that. Like and follow for more videos.